The Airbus satellite constellation continuously delivers valuable information about our planet and our environment. In the summer of 2022, extensive parts of Europe and the Northern Hemisphere experienced exceptional weather events. In the south of France, forest fires broke out near the Dune de Palat and in the Londres forest. The Spot 6 image required on the 18th of July 2022 clearly shows the extent of the burned forest, the two fires that are still in progress and winds that are pushing the fires towards the Dune de Palat. The before and after imagery taken by Playa des Neo shows a fire near Landeras and helps measure the extent of the burned scar. Damaged crop types can be identified as well as other valuable information for insurance claims. The reactivity of Playa das Neo in terms of tasking, acquisition and delivery makes it possible to deliver insights to emergency teams in a timely manner. Near Landeras, the fires shown were contained and the homes in danger were identified thanks to the 30cm native resolution. Emergency teams on the ground were alerted. The hot weather also put additional strain on glaciers. A Playa das Neo image of the Marmolada Glacier in Italy was analysed and details the steps of the collapse. The part of the glacier that has melted, the ice and the rock flow, the rock flow over several hundred metres. On a Playa das Neo image required two months earlier, tears in the ice at the edge of the stool zone attest to movements of the glacier already at work. Radar and optical satellite imagery also allows users to visualise the effects of drought on lake water levels by comparing images. The Playa das image from 2021 shows the Val de Cannes Reservoir in Spain full of water. The water level of the lake changes in the radar Terrasar X image from August 2022, and the shores are exposed in the Playa des Neo image from August 2022. But surprise can arise. Megaliths that are over 4,000 years old have resurfaced, known as the Cromlick or Grout de Parel, also dubbed the Spanish Stonehenge. The drought allows archaeologists to study the area for additional information from the past.